I'm Justin Frickley, the forage specialist with Millbourne Seeds. We're out here in a field of teff grass, and teff grass has gained a lot of popularity as of late, and for some very good reasons. Okay, teff grass, it's a warm season annual forage, um, and it makes very nice hay. Okay, so last year as a nation, we got extremely low on forage supplies. Um, our on-farm storage was extremely low, and so people were trying to look for alternative ways to make up for that shortage. And uh, teff grass came up in a lot of conversations I had with guys. Uh, where I saw it used most commonly is, let's say you get you took off your first cutting of alfalfa first of June. We're starting to warm up, and uh, you, you realize that stand was very, very thin. Um, teff grass is a great one to come in and intercede back into that, that stand. Um, and that's going to boost production for that second and third cutting. This was a this was seeded in Memorial Day weekend, straight stand of teff grass at eight pounds per acre. And this teff grass was was actually uh, the variety we used was Moxie, which is a variety from Berenbrook, and it's a coated seed. You see, teff grass is extremely fine, smaller than alfalfa, and so seeding it is very very critical. It needs to be planted into a very firm seed bed at a shallow depth. And coating that seed can help with flowability and just making sure that you can meter your drill down to about that 8 to 10 pounds per acre mark. Okay, so as you can see in the windrow, this is just cut last night. It's drying very fast because it's so narrow bladed and fine stem. And when we wrap this up in a bale, it's going to look very attractive. And our feed quality is going to be very good because the leaf to stem ratio is very high. When we ever have, we have that in a plant, digestibility is good. We have less lignin content in that bale, so our fiber digestibility, our fiber digestibility is very good. Uh, so this is a great, great quality feed as well. Okay, so this is a good example of teff. Remember, if you ever have any questions, you're wondering what your your own particular situation, uh, make sure you look us up. Call us at Millbourne Seeds there, and I'd be glad to help you. Thanks for watching.